Hi guys, welcome to week six. I have such fantastic news for you. You are eight exercises away from finishing the essential math repertoire. So if you have been with me from day one, you have eight more to go before we can start looking at some of the more challenging intermediate and advanced exercises. If you are new, I really recommend going back to the beginning and learning those exercises from the start because the idea is that they do build up and they do build up in um, technicality, uh, in difficulty and uh, the endurance and strength that you need. So yeah, so I know the audio isn't great here guys, it is a little echoey, but um, at the moment Amazon isn't shipping anything to Mexico City, that's not essential. So just bear with me and as soon as um, I can get back onto Amazon.com, I will sort out a solution to make the audio a little bit better for you. All right, so excellent. We are going to start with the teaser. Everybody loves the teaser. They want to perfect the teaser. It's a beautiful looking exercise, but it is really damn hard. So there are many versions of the teaser, um, primarily in the advanced um, repertoire category, um, but there are some in the essential and intermediate. So we're going to look through three of them at the moment, um, and they range in difficulty. All right, so I will do a few reps like normal, and then I'll talk you through them. All right, here goes. Uh, okay. Oh, I hope I'm warmed up for this. <laughs> Okay, so this is essential one. I want you to come lying supine. I want your knees bent and make sure your ankles aren't too close to your seat. So you need to have them further away from you in order to articulate through your spine. Your feet are nice and together and uh, your legs are together as well. And really make sure your feet stay on the mat here, okay? I want you to find that neutral pelvis, so by now you certainly should have found that. Your ribs need to be pulling down towards your pelvis, so nice and soft, so no popping ribs. Yeah, can you see that? Arms are overhead. Now you can choose, so experiment a little bit here, whether you want the palms up or the palms facing in. So some people will find it easier and more movement in the shoulders with the palms facing up and others prefer to roll the uh, palms to um, the midline. So I like to have my palms facing up. So we inhale, we bring the arms to the ceiling. Exhale, we nod the chin and we roll up through the vertebrae. And we come to sit just behind the sitting bones and our arms are nice on the diagonal. I want you to lengthen the top part of the spine. Inhale, bring the hands to the ears. Exhale, use your glutes, tuck your pelvis. Start to roll down through the spine and bring the arms back overhead. Let's do that again. Inhale, the arms to the ceiling. Exhale, nod the chin, roll through the spine, come to sit just back of the sit bones, arms nice and diagonal, and lift the top part of the spine. But keep the lumbar spine flexed. Inhale, the arms by the, uh, by the ears. Exhale, use your glutes, tilt your pelvis, bring your pubic bone to your nose, helps you roll through the spine and arms back behind you. So, last one, inhale, exhale, roll up, arms nice on the diagonal, look forward, inhale, arms by the ears, exhale, use your glutes, tilt the pelvis towards you, roll back and come back down to the mat. Okay, great, so you can progress this now, 
by bringing one leg, um, uh, raising one leg on the diagonal, okay? And it's the same cueing technique. Inhale the arms to the ceiling. Exhale, nod the chin, roll through the vertebrae, come to sit just off the sitting bones, lengthen the top of the spine. Inhale the arms by your ears. Exhale, really reach that leg away from you. Use your glutes, tilt the pelvis to roll down evenly through the spine. Let's do one more so you can see that again. Inhale. Exhale, nod the chin, roll through the spine, come to sit just off the sit bones, lengthen the top of the thoracic, arms by your ears. Now here, really lengthen the toes away, tilt the pelvis, and come to roll down. Perfect. Now, if you're still finding this super easy, I'm sure you're not, but if you are, you can extend that even further by having your knees and legs in tabletop. Some more for you. Alright guys, see you soon. Bye.